real quick. One, two, hey, one, two. I see you right there, Humble Beast. Pete Campbell's out. Yes! Well, let me tell you guys an embarrassing story. Um, it's the first time I ever really like asked out a girl. It's really bad. Are you gonna tell that one? I'm gonna move back real quick. Tell not that good. one. Not good. This is not a good story. Um, I went to the movies. I was like 16, and I saw this girl. And you know, guys, when you see a pretty girl in front of your friends, all your friends are like, "Go talk to her." And you're like, "No, no, no she's ugly." I'm like, "You know, she's pretty." She's like, "No, I want to talk to her." And you know, they convinced me to go up to her and. And talk to her, but like I never like I don't know why. What happens when guys see girls that are pretty? We don't our, our words we forget them. I don't know what it is. So she mentioned she's this. She wasn't as skinny, but um, <laughs> I, I, I walked. I, I got this close to her. This is as far as I got to her, and I and I screamed at her, and I said, "Hey, I like your face." <laughs> True story. True story. She's like, "Are you are you yelling at me?" No. Not, but uh, you're nice. You're fit. You want food? With a, a plate of food one day. She's like, I don't know. You're scaring me. And I remember because my friends they pump me up and they're like, Listen, the worst thing she could say is no. So like, what's the worst that can happen? I was like, True. So I go up to this girl and I'm like, Listen, um, I know I'm, I'm overweight, but would you like to hang out with me? I can't fit a normal rides when I go to theme parks. I need two seats. And she and, and I said, do you, do you want to go get some food? And she said, get away from me, you loser. Bruh. And I went to my friend and I'm like, I thought the worst thing they could say is no. I thought that... <laughs> the truth is that I believe that as Christians, we should embrace these moments. And I believe that sometimes there's awkward moments, but they're really opportunities. You know, that, that idea of being awkward is like, you don't know what's going to happen. Sometimes when you're obedient to God, you shut up. <laughs> Sometimes when you're obedient to God, you don't know what's going to happen. But it's in those moments that amazing things happen. And so we have the song, it's called Awkward. Let's try it. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. If you brought your loved one or you got your little secret in mind. Do the yawn. Like, do the yawn. Yeah, you can do a little hog and, you know, get that I like the yawn. The yawn works. We're trying to help y'all out. Hey. Don't judge me. Don't judge us. Judge not. It's you be judged. <laughs> you sent me a request and I accepted. Here we go. But I didn't Here know you go. at all. She started liking pictures from way back when. My homies have said you're a stalker. But I told them at least I think she's cute. She was, in the at face, least, in the face. Like I said, in comments, and I saw you out at school. It's us. Hey, Tama. Well, isn't it awkward that we see each other every day, but we don't speak at all? Well, isn't it awkward that we're close on the internet, but real life we're so far? Stranger, don't I look familiar to you? Maybe, I don't know. I think 